Okay, we're on Kufya Dalit, and we had been down, we got down to number Tess Zion. So, like I said, this was a little bit, and this is in the Tiv, the, the uh, Chef, uh, Gavonos, and I tried to go there and then move along. I did look at the thing in the back, and we could, we could try that, see if it, it was not that easy for me to pick out what he's saying. Let's, let's, uh, let's go backwards, pick up the, um, Pick up the the beginning of this on page Kufiyot base, and it says the zivug the lilo who the tzorik a zivug the young, v'hinek of the zivug shall the lilo bein zivug the abba ve'imek of the bein zivug the zun, the came in shuhu gerua mezivug shall the young that has a mukrach then it has to be connected to it, who she here the tzorik haschalas tikun the zivug shall the young, so it's for the purpose of getting the ball going on the tikun the young. This zivug, which takes place at night time, it causes what? A tikkun and the preparation of the klia yisod de nukva. Now we're about to get to the place where we want to read now. So he says, I think it's just kind of interesting. Let me get a drink here. Uh, kind of, kind of interesting what he says. The word verbiage. He says, "Tiku nekonen is clear a yisod the nukva." So it's preparing the the yisud. Why? Why? Kadesh tuchul acher kach. Because if there's no kli there, it's impossible kach laalos man bekol bekli hachu bezivug and the azabiyom. So if there's no preparation for the nukva, she's apparently not able to be ma'alaman. Let's go over to number Tazayan down below and let's see if we can pick that up and uh, get a little bit closer. He says, The Tikkun of a Gonen is clear that you saw the Nukva. Af al pe af da mai rega bekan the Rebbein of Rebbeinian the Tikkun, the Nesinus Harucha Bebiya Rishona. This is the concept, this is the Bia Rishona. And so we're talking about the Tikkun that takes place as a result of a Ve'im Kain, if that's the case, Madua Korela Lezeh B'Shem Tikkun Klicha Yisod. Why is it called the Tikkun of the Klicha Yisod? Although the Tikkun Klicha Yisod, the Nuk, who Tikkun Acher, it's a different Tikkun, Bifnei Atzbo, Hana Azach Al Yedecha Yedayim De'im Akadolachamon. So it's really talking about that. Asoch Yisoch V'Chachem. Matzina laharbe lacharav. He said be etzchaim over there in Shar Yud Aleph, Perik Vav. Shakora gam lebechinas harucha b'shem kli. So why he says that you would shakora gam ab lebechinas harucha the the aspect of the rucha which represents the male aspect. It's also called a kli. Kaven shacharucha hu kli. Uh, it becomes the rucha becomes a kli for the man hamislavshimbo which is clothed within it. Uh, let's try to figure that out. The rucha. Uh, see, normally, so I'm thinking that the ruach is inside of the kli is inside of of the yisod. But here he says that in uh, the going that that's that's when you're looking at it from the standpoint of the male. The male is going into the female, it's been to the female, but now you're going to reverse it and you're going to have the female sending up Maya Nukvin through the through the Rucha, which is the male. A Vakabin Shah Rucha who Kli uh who I think it's Kli, a Lachaman of his Lavshimbo, which is clothed now in it because the Rucha is now inside of that and therefore they're right together. And so therefore she can now bring up Maya Nukvin so that's in Os Beis, uh, Os Yod Beis, or Beis Lachem Yehuda has that also. So then we have another one, one more, I think, Tezai, oh, oh, that was where, that, wait, 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 wait. Uh, okay, so that was Tezvav. Oh, wow, I read the wrong one, but let's go to Tezai. So he said, uh, so Tezai says, G'day she'tuchul achar kach la'alos mayim b'kli ha'ku b'zivuk ana'aze b'yom. So he says the fee mashu huva the air the 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 sheet is a rishash. Haziva uh uh the chasi is clean. Hanaazer a belayla that that yichud that takes place at night time. 
who bezuna kololim the kad shal. Now that's where we, I want it to be. That's the zuna kololim the kad shal. Once again, he says the kli that's made at nighttime, who bezuna kololim the kad shal. That's the the one. So kad shal, I think from looking in the back, and I'm still not clear about it, but it seems like when you get to Marav, the which is the beginning of the next day, you're still working on what started earlier in the previous day. Right, so maybe that's what he means by the Shah, the the Kad Shah. So he said of the Hakolim, the Kad Shah, which are twenty four hours. He said, "Vehinda habezivuk da asias kli bezun Hakolim, the Kad Shah." That zivuk for the Kad Shah, and the Asa Belel Yom Bay. So it takes place on the night time of the second day. So in other words, you go you go around the around I guess the horn starting on the night time of the previous day. And go through different the the, the uh, three different the zivugim or four I'm not sure how you count you count the zivug of, of uh, Yaakov and Leah at nighttime and then the yichud that takes place between Malchus and and uh, Rachel and Yaakov in the daytime twice that's three times and then you have the fourth time he's going to come back around on the nighttime again I think he talks about that in the back we'll see maybe we can see that a little bit better. So he yon base a belil yon base. Ve'elach a v'ziva the holy the zun a kolalim. So that that yichud that's going to the zun a kolalim the kad cha na'asach a b'defilas a paim the yon gimel. It really happens. It takes all the way down until you get to the third day. Not sure how this works. I wish I had a guide to see how that works. There is a little bit more to it. Uh, so he says a paim the yon gimel nimsa shaha amor kan that we're talking about here. He said, uh, so therefore, let's see, uh, it's not a kavana for a yichud that takes place in the, in the, in the morning of the next day. He says, he says, but a yichud for the day that's coming after it. So, Kind of confused about how you do this. Va'ayin o b'pesach anayim. You look over there. He's got more. He, he's on that. Valnir and Aliyah's died. The sheet is l'shitaso. So he said v'lahashitas hasovrim. According to the opinion of those who hold, who hold, where I, I just have a little bit more to do. The the milvad zu na'asach ke'ez gam zivug kli v'ruchu b'petzufi yako v'leyach apratim. He said, "Rabbi Yesh Lomad the Kan Myra Rabbi Chazuva the Yaakov Aleya the Ziva Gzel of Kuch Alchana the Ziva the Yaakov Arachol the Lamachar." We'll see how that goes. That's going to happen later on. And he says, "Yuun Ma Shekasav the Bezeba Meluim." And tomorrow we're going to look at the Meluim and Metzashat. Okay.